We missed you. Did you miss us? Well, after our lovely uh, summer wine tastings on Zoom, we're going to have another six and to take us through from 2nd of October through to the 4th of December. So you can come into as many of these as, or as few as you want. Um, but each evening is going to be three wines and each evening we've got another lovely winemaker to uh, join us. So quickly through them is um, first week is going to be um, Miss Diane, Diane de Primoire. She's going to come and join us from Chateau d'Or de Girl and we're going to do some Shiraz. Uh, and other things. Each time there's going to be other things. Second week, um, we've got Laurent Mikel joining us from a bit, uh, same sort of area, a bit further south, and he's going to taste with us a couple of his wines, including this really lovely Albarino, which you'd normally expect to see in Spain, but here's a French one. Then we've got um, uh, Herbert Zillinger coming. Now Herbert, as we all know, makes some fantastic wines um, and he's going to join us and talk about um, his wines and Austria. We're going to taste some over the border stuff with, um, from, from Slovenia at the same time, just to compare and contrast, but, and we'll have a red as well from somewhere else, but it'll be a lovely tasting. Uh, and then we got a fizz tasting, so uh, Clotilde, Clotilde Chauvet is going to join us from Champagne and her Champagne quite frankly has got to be one of the best in the country irrespective of price and yes this is super value for money. We're going to contrast her wonderful Champagne with Prosecco from Italy and a red fizz also from Italy so that I think you're going to enjoy that tasting as well. We're going to move on to Bordeaux and then Fabien uh, Vincent from Chateau Le Mont Vincent is going to join us and talk about his wine. So we have tasted one of his wines um, in a previous tasting, but this time we've got a real treat. We've got some stock of the Grand Rossignol 2016 vintage and this, if you ever want to taste what a really expensive claret tastes like but don't pay the money for a really expensive claret, this is the one for you. And then finally, we're going to uh, finish it off with going to go to Rioja, and that's going to be the 4th of December. And my old pal, uh, Miguel Marino, is joining us. Um, this is not the proper we'll be tasting because they haven't quite made it here yet. Um, Miguel um, and or his son, um, Miguel Jr., are going to join us, and we're going to taste a white Rioja, a Criantha, and then arguably one of the best Riochas you'll ever have tasted. So we do hope you'll join us. Um, we're going to be joined by Rachel again, as you know, uh, keeping us in control, and then behind the scenes, uh, keeping everybody here in control, making sure it all runs smoothly. Rita is going to be making sure that we don't go off piste, as it were, if you're a skier. Okay, looking forward to seeing you. Okay, bye. I feel better, oh. <laughs>